Hello guys, we are back with our next tutorial. Guys, I'll be just giving you a small introduction for this guys. Basically, because I'm not so familiar with this asynchronous transformers, I'll be just giving you a small, small introduction about each and every layer of it. So basically, I'll be providing you the final answer in the group guys. So if you are not still in the group, please join the group so that you will be getting the answer till tonight. Okay, so now let us go through asynchronous transform mode. So it is a switching technique used in telecommunication networks. So basically the phone calls and everything will be following this asynchronous transform mode guys. So data transmission is done in chunks. Chunk is nothing but a small group of data or group of messages. Okay, or group of voice. So it provides the interface between the user and the network. So this asynchronous transform mode will take care about the interaction between us and the network. Fine. So now let us go through layers of ATM. So the layers of ATM will be in this way guys. Guys basically this is a 3D diagram. Okay. So it will be having a physical layer, ATM layer, ATM adapter layer, upper layer and upper layer. We'll be having, this is the upper layer. And here we'll be having the user layer, control panel, layer management and plan management. Fine. So I hope everyone got a clear idea about the diagram. So now let us go through some one one line definitions of this. As I don't, I don't have clear idea. So I'll be just explaining you by reading the points guys. Sorry for that. Okay. So physical layer. It involves a special specification of a transmission medium and signal encoding schema data rate in physical layer ranges from 25 Mbps to 622 Mbps. So it involves a specification of a transmission medium. So in this physical layer, you will be having a particular medium like are you transmitting it in air or it in wired medium? If it is in wired medium, are you using copper wire or optical fiber wire or any other kind of wire? So in that way, we will be mentioning in physical layer and the signal encoding schemas like encoding and decoding will also be done here and data transfer rate will be at 25 Mbps to 622 Mbps. Okay. So ATM layer, the second layer is ATM layer. It provides the data to transfer the packets from physical layer to adopter layer. So that is the reason of that. So ALL, ALL is nothing but ATM adopter adoption layer. So here mapping of higher level information into ATM cell to be transported over this ATM network. So this data is transferred to the above layers, right? So with the help of this layer only, we'll be transferring them. But here we'll be dividing it into ATM cells, fine? So above we are having user panel. So this provides the information about the particular user. Control panel performs all the controls that and control functions. So it performs all the control functions. And the last layer is nothing but plane manager. So plane manager, it provides coordination between all the planes and layers of management. So I hope everyone got at least a small idea on this ATM layer. Guys, I'll be providing you a link of some website or I'll be just writing it and I'll be forwarding you the pics guys. So try to join the group till afternoon so that uh, after afternoon I'll be just posting this. Okay, so in the next tutorial we'll be going through the data transmission layer. Thank you. Thanks for watching.